Hi everyone, my name is Matteo Sodano, and together with my colleague Nika Zimmerman, I am going to present you the paper Constructing Metric Semantic Maps Using Floor Plan Priors for Long-Term Localization. Localization is an essential functionality of mobile autonomous systems. Being able to determine the robot's pose in a given map is the foundation for more complex tasks, such as planning and navigation. Mapping is also crucial for enabling the autonomy of a mobile agent. We utilize 3D object detection to construct object-centric maps, augmenting readily available floor plan maps with semantic information. In here, we only consider stable classes that are beneficial for long-term localization, such as sinks, fire extinguishers, and cabinets. This is an overview of our approach describing the main modules of our mapping and localization pipeline. First, we generate accurate 3D labels for object detection, accounting for dynamic occlusions. We analyze the performance of our object detection model and learn the error distribution associated with each class. This is a pre-computation that is only done once. The statistical analysis contributes to both mapping and localization together with the 3D object detections from RGB images. We utilize 2D object detection to create better 3D annotations. We improve pre-existing labels generated from a 3D model by accounting for dynamic occlusions. In the top row, the 2D object detections detects a door and none of the objects in the 3D map. Therefore, no 3D annotations are generated and colors are faded. In the bottom row, the 2D object detection detects tables and boards, but not the drawers due to occlusion. Therefore, 3D annotations are generated only for the boards and the tables, and not for the drawers, which is still faded. Given two non-overlapping object predictions of the same class, a key issue is determining whether they belong to the same instance suffering from noisy detection, or they are two separate instances in close vicinity. To address this problem, we analyze the per-class characteristic noise for detections, and we build a 2D probability distribution for each class. Given posed RGB images and a 3D object detector, we construct a metric semantic map to enhance a flow plan. We aggregate consecutive detections into a short-term local map by associating detected objects across different frames using the Hungarian algorithm. After the robot has moved, we uh, integrate the local map into the global object map using the same asset strategy. We obtain room segmentation from the floor plan. This allows us to associate objects to rooms, so we only update objects located in the same room we're currently in. These are the outputs of our mapping algorithm. We obtain a 3D metric semantic map and object probability map based on the statistical analysis we discussed previously. We globally localized using a Monte Carlo framework, integrating semantic information through our novel semantic sensor model. We use our 3D metric semantic map to localize, considering both geometric features and semantic cues based on the probability analysis of the accuracy of the 3D object detection model. We evaluated our constructed maps by matching them against a ground truth map extracted with a highly accurate 3D terrestrial laser scanner and annotated manually. The intersectional reunion scores between the ground truth map and our maps are high, while precision and recall are close to one, indicating a low number of false positives and false negatives. We also evaluated the performance of the localization based on our constructed maps to ensure that the constructed maps are indeed suitable for long-term localization. To assess the performance of our localization approach, we recorded 10 challenging sequences, including dynamic obstacles, the additional removal of furniture, and quasi-static changes, such as closing and opening of doors. Our localization approach outperformed the baselines, robustly localizing across all sequences with absolute trajectory error of 15 centimeters, achieving long-term localization. In summary, our contributions are we improve 3D label generation for fine tuning of 3D object detection models. We enrich readily available floor plans with metric semantic information. We achieve long term localization using our novel semantic sensor model, accounting for detection uncertainty. Um, we perform online and onboard uh, mapping and localization, and we also provide an open source code on GitHub. <laughs>